NFL facts that sound fake but are actually true. Part 16. Terry Bradshaw used the fake name of Tom Brady in 1983 to keep his surgery low profile and not make headlines. The real Tom Brady was only five years old at this time. The Houston Oilers have won two division titles in 1991 and 1993, more recently than the Cleveland Browns have won one in 1989. In the Super Bowl era, the lowest scoring playoff game took place during the 1970 divisional round match when the Cowboys beat the Lions 5-0. The Steelers have more playoff games at Ford Field in Detroit than the Lions do themselves. In 2021, Cam Newton famously yelled, I'm back. In the following NFL draft, the Panthers drafted these players. Pay attention to the first letter of each name. That's right, the first letter of each name spells, I'm back. The 2022 NFL Draft was the first NFL Draft in which no running backs or tight ends were drafted in the first round. From the years 1994 to 2016, quarterbacks drafted in the sixth round have the highest win percentage, highest playoff win percentage, and second most playoff wins compared to all other draft rounds. This is all thanks to Tom Brady, who was drafted in the sixth round. In Tom Brady's entire career, that's over 350 starts, his defense has not allowed 44 plus points once ever in his entire career. In Aaron Rodgers' 10 playoff losses, that's just 10 starts, his defense allowed 44 plus points three times. In the first 54 Super Bowls, no Super Bowl team won or played at their home stadium for the Super Bowl match. Then it happened twice in a row during Super Bowl 55 and Super Bowl 56. The New England Patriots almost became the St. Louis Stallions. The Pats were supposed to relocate to St. Louis in 1994, as that's where the team owner, Orthwine, wanted them to be, since he is a St. Louis native. However, the owner of the Foxborough Stadium, Robert Kraft, forced a stadium lease that ran through the year 2001, which eventually resulted in the Patriots staying in New England long term. The Steelers joined the NFL in 1933, but from the years 1933 through 1972, they only played in one postseason game in 1947 when they lost to the Eagles 21-0, shutout style. The longest gap from thrower to receiver with the same set of players is 18 years. This is when Brett Favre threw a pass to Brett Favre in Brett Favre's first ever NFL completion on September 13th, 1992, and then again in 2009 when Favre caught another of his own pass, which was a two-yard loss. The Jags are undefeated when they play their final game at home. They are 9-0 undefeated so far when the last game on their schedule is at home. They are also the only active NFL team to have never played on Thanksgiving Day. The Philadelphia Eagles are the only team to win a playoff game against Vince Lombardi when he was an NFL head coach. In 2016, you had more NFL rushing yards than Reggie Bush did. You had zero, he had negative three. Assuming you're not in the NFL or not Reggie Bush watching this. So here were NFL facts that sound fake but are actually true part 16. Let me know if you want to see a part 17. Don't forget to tackle that like button and subscribe with notifications turned on. I'm Touchdown Rewind and I'll fast forward to you later.